Welcome back. You know, it's the Van Rap Radio. Uh, guys, I definitely think uh, I did see this coming. Um, I'm not gonna like try and lie. Like, I had a feeling that this is gonna happen. Uh, the moment when he signed the deal with Warner Bros. or Sony, um, I just knew something like when, when his contract finished with Open Mic, he's not going to stay. Like, definitely is not going to stay. And, yeah, now it has happened, yeah? Wanitua Mus Entertainment. <laughs> it's out there right now. Uh, as we speak, Master KG has his own record label called Wanitua Mus uh, Entertainment. And uh, already he has signed uh, one artist uh, who, is, who, who is a DJ. Uh, the artist, the name by the name of DJ Mwazilu. Hey, Mazina, I know any names, names, names. Yeah. So you already signed someone on the record label. Um, so, like, I don't know how these guys will be feeling because, you know, man, losing one of your major star or major artist, um, yo, man, is too much, man. It's too much because um, what he said was like um, he launched uh, its own record label, Wanito Amos Entertainment. And then all these projects, everything that he's going to be doing now is going to be released under Wanito, which is signed with Sony or uh, Warner Bros. So he's no longer, there's no middleman now. Like it's not a three pie. Like uh, you have uh, Sony, then you have uh, Master KG, I uh, mean, no, Sony. Then you have, uh, <laughs> what do you call this? You have, why am I f forgetting this guy's name? Op okay, you have Sony, you have Open Mic Production, and then Master KG, which means he get whatever these guys shares, and he get the leftovers. So right now, they're going to be sharing, like it's like it's working directly with these guys. So yeah, he signed the record label, I think it's on his own terms, which becomes great. Uh, I wish him all the best, man. I'm wishing him all the best. Uh, it's been a long way coming. You've done great. Uh, and then that article on the City Press that he discovered Makazi, I felt like, come on, guys. Nah, 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 nah. Master Keji didn't discover Makazi. They, they were working together all this time. Uh, they worked together, which built up to um, when, when, when she separated with Rita D, which I don't want to get too much into the details. Then she got signed by Open Mic, you know, because by the time uh, Open Mic signed Makaz, Makaz was already major, was already big. She was out there uh, through Rita D Entertainment. Matorokis was shining big. So I don't understand when somebody says discovered, like, huh? what the heck? She did, she'd been dominating the industry. She'd been doing big already. So whatever they wrote in that article i i don't know where they get it but yeah man enough about that so yeah makazi uh, i'm sorry uh master kg have left uh, open mic production and the project that uh gonna be released under when the music electra france um you know so yeah he's gonna be doing that and this you know right now he's still touring man that song jerusalem uh, uh, these guys can say it's set for life by that song. That song is out there. It's still dominating. It's still big. Uh, because now we got this my piano and all the thing that is dominating here. New songs almost every day, which are great songs, dope songs. Out there in other places and other countries in Europe and all that. They're still enjoying Jerusalem like it's brand new. So yeah, man, it's great for Master KG. He's still cashing in on that song. I wish he owned the masters of the song, man. This would be great, 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 great. Uh, and this came after, you know, when living, with him living uh, open mic, it's coming after uh, Nomskaiwa already left, man, also, uh, signed with Sony. So, yeah, man, it's, it's, it's something like that, man. It's something like that. I don't know how it feels, but they still have Makazi, they still have Mr. Brown. I don't know uh, what is the name of those, who joined Vuligate, those guys. Uh, I think they're still there. I don't know if they're still with the record label. Uh... What is the name of that other one? Ah, I forgot his name. Yeah, but enough about this. Yeah, maybe maybe they'll be able to push these other artists that they have on their stable uh, bigger and bigger. So, yeah, man. Nah, from my side, I'm just saying big up to Master KG for starting his own record label. He's out there. It's Wani Tuomo's Entertainment. Nah. I don't know what you guys think, but I think he did a great move.